if you're okay, you're on screen mum. Was there doing the iftas over the weekend? Did you catch it at I all? I did. I really, really enjoyed watching it and Liam Neeson's speech was brilliant and Chris O'Dowd as well went up and said a few <sighs> skipped over that bit. <laughs> but um yeah, was, I really enjoyed the show, actually. It was really good. Do you get a sense that you kind of feel like you're missing out when you're not with them? Do you feel a part of you is kind of missing when you see the two of them off hanging out? Yeah, I suppose. Um, it, I, when did we film the last season? Maybe it was 2013, I kind of, during the summer of that. Or, that's a long time ago now. I'd love if they could... You know, they've been talking about maybe doing something else or kind of doing another series or even a mov movie, but... Um, uh, they haven't like 100% said, oh yeah, we're going to do it, you know, it's fine. But so hopefully if they did do something, I'd definitely 100% be on board for it. Like. Yeah, you must be getting sick of kind of the movie questions. But if there was one to happen, where do you think your character would go? Where do you think Martin moves? I, I was just saying like, um, if you, you know the way there's kind of that thing of in the first, second series, they kind of hinted at, you know, he's getting a bit old for an imaginary friend. But well, he's always a bit too old. But now he's like, you know, now it's kind of like cop on. <laughs> so maybe they could kind of do something about, you know, kind of now he's much older kind of whether he wants to keep this other part of him in his life or if he wants to let him go or I don't know it's something they could explore so you'll see how it goes anyway with fingers crossed that the movie does come on soon and I suppose you're still in school so dealing with all this fame did you kind of get once you first on tv did you get a lot of people coming up to you in school trying to get a selfie or were they acting different towards you or did everyone leave you alone um I'm in a very small school in in Leitrim <laughs> um, so I remember for going in national school like no, when I started filming nobody really knew what I was doing they were like he's been sick for the past six weeks it's very strange when I came back I was yeah I was just uh, filming this thing um, you know it was for Sky One they're like sure <laughs> I must have been really sick <laughs> but um, and then so they kind of got used to it and that and um, when I went into secondary school it was like a whole new people load of people and they might just stop me in the hallway this is like in first year and go you're that from Mumbai? And I'd just be like, uh, yeah, maybe song. And they'd just walk on. And that, that might happen, you know, like maybe 10 people or something. And then it would just be over. And no one really ever mentions it, you know, <laughs> anymore. But uh, there is no like, oh, would you get a selfie or anything like that in school? That is kind of weird. But <laughs> <laughs> Not yet, anyway. And the teacher's <laughs> like, hey. <laughs> well, you never know. They could be cheekily doing it behind a photo bomb. <laughs> <laughs> just as he's in class. <laughs> and I suppose because... Uh, you grew up kind of on the show. Do you see kind of Chris O'Dowd as a mentor to you for acting or like as an older brother or such? That would be terrible. <laughs> He'd be a terrible mentor. I do Yeah, definitely. Um, Chris is like um, really, really down to earth and he's really sound and nice. It doesn't matter like even if they're behind schedule or anything like that. He was always really like nice to people and uh, always really calm and that. And it's just something that you wanted to like take with you when you're if you're doing big things like that as well. Because he even directed the third series. That's a huge commitment. He wrote it. He was in it. He was directing it. Like, imagine. I, I, I probably wouldn't be able to do that. Like, in just, in, I don't know how long we did it for, maybe eight weeks. He'd just be fed up the whole time. And But he just he just did it with such grace and that. It was great. So it was handy to have a good positive energy around then. So. And um, you're doing your junior cert, is it this year? Yes, in a couple of weeks. <laughs> how are you feeling? Are you nervous? Are you, are you ready for it? Am I ready for it? Um, if any of my teachers are listening, 100%. <laughs> um, um, but, yeah, I suppose I'm kind of ready for it. I mean, Has, have you taken a break from acting then to kind of focus on it? Oh, you're like, yeah. No, even 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 the drama group, I'm kind of like, yeah, it might not be in next week, you know. I have a bit of work to do, lads. <laughs> but, uh, even, yeah, just, um, I mean, obviously, it's, it's kind of, it's, it is a big deal, like the junior yeah. even though it doesn't actually amount to anything but it's still kind of it's still important that you know you're there for it and that you, you try and do as well as possible but uh, the mocks went well enough like but and the mini mocks as well mini mocks pre mock mocks but uh, is there enough exams for you but you know what you'll do well you're not no bother to you um are you on snapchat because this is the new thing Niall Horan Laura Whitmore can we expect overall on snapchat to go public I think I was on snapchat but I just I think it's a bit addictive like so I, I don't I don't really use it. I don't think I have it on a. I don't think I really you like I don't have it on my phone or anything like that. But uh, I think I used to be on it. But now they have, they have all these updates and everything, and I'd just be like obsessed. Like when I should be studying, I'd just be like, 
watching the rainbows coming out of my mouth or something like that. But um, the, the new filtery things. Anyway. <laughs> oh, we all know that one. We all use yeah, it ourselves. Yeah. And I suppose finally, though, do you keep in touch with all the Moonboy cast? Do you have like a WhatsApp group or anything where you just keep on going, yeah. chatting to each other? Um, we, we used to definitely, like, remember I used to like call up Ian like nearly every week, like just to see what he was at and that this is Cork and Moonboy. And um, we're just kind of less so now because it's kind of awkward, you know, meeting people. But I mean, always always there'd be nearly every couple of months you know i'd be seeing them at this event or this event or that event or doing this thing together so um just kind of keep in touch that way and you know mess messages and that and um but yeah keep it going. so then after the junior circuit we can expect you to be back on the acting scene anyway yeah definitely <laughs> hopefully i mean i'm going you know summer and then ty so it wouldn't be too bad to maybe take a few weeks off you never know you never know well good luck with everything and thank you so much for chatting to us